Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. Luna's just been making me laugh here because she's stuffing two balls into her mouth. Well, look at her, she thinks I'm going to try and get one of them. She's guarding them with her life. But anyway, I hope everyone's doing well. I just wanted to come on and say a big thank you to everybody who's been subscribing to the channel and liking the videos. It's very much appreciated. And I'm um, growing the channel every single day, which is fantastic. But I thought I would come on. It's uh, been raining all day today. But it's actually a welcome relief because it's been absolutely scorching here. And Luna hadn't been well, so the weather cooling down and um, stopping her sweating is really helping for that rash and everything that she had to clear up. But she's doing fantastic and she's more or less back to her normal self, apart from her, her white powder on her, which is quite funny. But, um, but yeah, so some good news is, for those who've been following me on the channel, you'll be aware that um, I moved down south maybe just under a year ago. So we've been living in a very small studio flat, which I've done nothing with because it was just temporary and a lot of my stuff is all still in storage. But good news is I signed for a new place yesterday and we're going to be moving in on Monday. So that's fantastic. I'll be able to unpack all my stuff. I'll be able to get my studio set up and um, make it feel like home. So are you gonna come? Are you just gonna lie there? What are you doing? Luna looks so funny because that powder's all around her ears. Have you turned into a gray shepherd or a silver shepherd, as they say? Have you turned into a silver shepherd? But she's very much back to herself personality wise because she was a little bit down. But um she's got all her old pet back, even though she does look a bit balder in places, but it's not really a lot we can do for that. But she's getting there. The trickiest part has been at night time just to try and prevent her from scratching herself or biting herself because I couldn't put the cone on her through the night because it was just way too hot and she would have sweated like crazy so I had to lie beside her at night to make sure that she didn't um, bite at herself or scratch at herself but she did have a full vest on one with legs on at night so it was just mainly not getting letting her scratch at her ears and scratch at herself so as you can imagine me lying beside her at night I've not been getting the best to sleep but I'd rather that than her digging holes in herself. But she's more or less, the scratching has stopped now. So it's just a matter of, um, I'm just putting some powder on just some of the little areas, the little patchy areas that are still remaining, but nothing really serious. It's just a matter now of her fur growing back in. So once her coat molts again for the winter that'll all come back in so it's not going to do her any harm we lose a bit of fur i think she probably quite appreciates it so anyway that's the update so just a big thank you to everybody and um i'll probably post a little video apologies if you can hear the wind in this video because it is a little bit windy And I'll post a little update um, once we move in on Monday. But I'll put my normal, you know, 
chatty videos that I put up in my shorts of Luna. I still keep putting them up. But I'll do another little update when we move in on Monday morning. Okay, so thank you very much from me and my girl. Take care.